Um, we'd like to do a second song by him, also uh, kind of drawing on that Afro-Cuban rhythm um, groove that we've been doing a little bit of tonight. Um, this is a song that he wrote for his sextet back in 1936. This is called Caravan. And it's going to feature a couple of our special guests that we have in our rhythm section playing with us. Um, hold your applause to Dino and announce them first. Um, Robert on bass, Ryan on drums, and Greg on piano.
what's interesting about his approach to that song is, as you were listening to it, you probably heard a lot of things that sounded like they clashed and they didn't go together. Um, he's a very progressive style of writer, has a lot of different intricacies of melody and harmony in his writing. Um, and this piece was part of his take on what Duke Ellington's music did for jazz back in the 20s. His writing was very progressive and very different. So um, this particular arrangement took that idea one step farther and updated it about 100 years. So like a Philip Mossman's arrangement of Caribou. The next song we'd like to play for you uh, is an old ballad, an old standard that was written um, by a songwriter, another Tin Pan Alley um, show musical songwriter named Toby Carmichael. Um, he's known for a couple different uh, songs in the jazz repertoire, probably most famously Stardust, and also um, the next song which we're going to play is called Georgia On My Mind. Um, he wrote that in 1930. Many of you probably know the Ray Charles arrangement because he was known for that song. Um, a lot of people associate that song with Ray Charles, but it was actually a much, much older song. So this is our take on George Ott. Thank you. 
saxophone soloists on that song. Um, before we play our last song of the evening tonight, I do want to take a moment and recognize we do have seniors in the band. Uh, some of them will be with us another semester, but some of them are graduating and moving on at the end of this one. So if you're graduating and um, you are a senior, please sing. on tenor tonight, both in the jazz combo and the jazz ensemble, and also Josh, who I think is one of our longest running medical semesters. Nine semesters. I think he has the record. <laughs> so the last song we'd like to play tonight is a Tower of Power song, uh, some jazz funk for you. This is called What is Hip? <laughs>
go. Are you doing an announcement? Uh, yes, if you are students and you have the little cards that you use to get into this concert, there are two people outside those doors standing on chairs. Hand your cards to those people standing on chairs. 